Son of a glitch. Super Mario World. You know, it's amazing that after all these years, new glitches are still being discovered for it. The cloud glitch is a perfect example, and in this episode, we're going to explore its mysteries. When the game begins, head to Yoshi Island 2. As small Mario, grab a Yoshi from the block. Eat this red shell, then fire it off here, creating three fireballs. Then eat the green shell and hold on to it. Jump up these three ledges like so. Place the green shell at the top of the fourth ledge. Turn left and then quickly turn right, and then tap X and A together. Then quickly tap the R button. You'll now see that your item box is glitched out, and that's the cloud. Okay, now let's break this all down slowly. After you have Yoshi, make your way to the red shell and tap Y to have Yoshi eat it. When you reach these two bushes, jump and then fire the red shell no higher than this or lower than this apple. Continue heading right and then press Y to eat the green shell. When you approach the ledges, it's crucial you keep up your speed. So jump on the first ledge and then jump over the second to land on the third. Get right in the corner of the third ledge and press down and Y to place the shell at the edge of the fourth ledge. And now here's where things get real. Tap left and then the fireball takes out the green shell to produce a coin. When the coin is here, tap right X and A together to make Mario spin jump and Yoshi will also stick out his tongue. During this motion, press the R shoulder button to scroll the camera. If performed correctly, the cloud should appear in your item box as this glitched sprite. We'll get to the uses of the cloud in a second, but let's look at why this happens. When Mario collects a coin that Yoshi is trying to eat, it creates a null sprite on Yoshi's tongue. By scrolling the screen right, we can fill that null sprite with a charging Chuck who is slightly off screen. Scrolling right spawns the Chuck and then it appears at the end of Yoshi's tongue, enabling him to eat it. Eating Chucks in any other situation isn't possible, but this glitch abuses the fact that Chucks have a give power up when eaten by Yoshi bit set. And so, when you do eat the Chuck, you get an item in your reserve box. If the glitch isn't quite performed correctly, you'll most likely crash the game, and this is because the Chuck can still hurt Mario. So what's with the cloud, and why is it such a big deal? Well, apart from it being fun as hell to use, the cloud is also a useful speedrun tactic. It helps skip some of the animation during the final Bowser fight by having the cloud on screen, though it's not known why this occurs. The glitch saves a good 35 to 40 seconds depending on how well the fight goes, meaning the old world record times have been beaten and are now being improved. Now this glitch is very similar to the orb glitch, so check out the very first episode of the series to find out more about how all this works, and remember, have fun using the cloud glitch. Also, a big thanks to Dano Diffused, Link Dead, Minecraft Sefbling, Virus610, and Dram551 as they really helped to make this episode. And if you like this episode, hit that like button, share it with everyone you know and love, but most importantly, please subscribe if you want to see more from the series.